Morning, people. Um, I need to talk to every do every pet dog owner out there today. Here she comes to be supportive. Yes, you, you're a very good girl. Um, I got assaulted uh, for protecting Zed. Now, look, I understand that pet dog owners don't have a clue about training dogs. I, I do, I do understand. But it's no good watching videos on here thinking, oh, they're doing well or whatever, and not applying it. Now, Zed, Zed was on a down, and we were doing our own thing, staying out of everybody's way as usual. And two small dogs um, started charging her with pilo erectus. Uh, hackles up, okay, yeah. Um, and all I did, okay, was put my hand out as so and say, Oi, enough. And the dogs turned around and went away. The girl turned around and said to me, You touch my dogs, I touch you. The next thing I know is I've been hit in the shoulder, okay, which because of my PTSD made me freeze. This one here, because she, yeah, she could have turned around and bit that girl. She could have, but she didn't because of training. She got up in between us, she put her paws on my chest and she pushed me back into safety and brought me back to here and now. Now... I would ask that every dog owner that owns a dog, a pet dog, that isn't trained, if you cannot be bothered to train it, then don't please let it off a lead, okay? You know, th this stupid concept of, my dog's friendly, it's only coming to say hello. It's got pilo erectus. Hackles up. Sorry. I'm going into scientific dog trainer mode, which I don't like myself. I am sorry. This has been, you know, Zed was working solidly for 36 hours because I was in such a state. This is unacceptable. It is unacceptable. It is. If you are too lazy to train your pet dog, you shouldn't have a dog. Dogs need more than water, food, and a walk. They have a brain. They are a highly intelligent species. They need mental stimulus just as much, if not more, than that walk. You know, I personally think it's on a 50%, 50%. You know, I really do. I met a young man yesterday. First dog. He's a first ever dog. And it's one of the best trained dogs up there on that field. Next to Z. You know, dogs need discipline. They are not fur babies. They are not surrogate children. They are nothing like that. You need to understand what dog is, what dog means, what dog needs. And fussing and pampering and teach, treating them like little kids is not it. They need discipline, people. They need structure, boundaries, limitations. They need to know the difference between right and wrong. Ignoring bad behaviour and only praising the good achieves absolutely nothing. Okay? So, you know, I, I could hardly use my left arm yesterday. Um, right, it's Saturday day, so the, the, the assault happened on Thursday. Um, supposedly the police are dealing with it but they're pretty useless over here probably shouldn't say that but they are I can see I'll probably have to get in touch with my MP to get anything done but you know this is an assault that has caused actual bodily harm and I do not intend to let it go I did not swear at her I did not touch her or her dogs yet she punched me and spat in my face now I'm sorry I am registered disabled my dog is a service dog which therefore is covered by Finn's law in the UK. If you cannot control your dog, do not let it off a lead. Ever. You know, all you're doing is making the whole situation with dogs look bad to the general populace because all people see is dogs rushing here, rushing there, no recall, dog fights. Bentry Secrets, little dog Tula's just been attacked. And just so you know, if you've got to deal with a dog fight, 
You've got to be calm. Zed did not get harm. Zed will not protect herself because she sees me as her protector. I will protect her. It's my job to protect my service dog from harm. That young girl, who clearly has never had any discipline and thinks she's absolutely the bee's knees. I mean, because unfortunately, where I go, there is this clique of really nasty women who, she said to me, this girl, you are hated up here. I don't care who hates me. You know, she was like, look at you with your red head and your ripped jeans. Look at stay here. You know, highly unintelligent comments. You know, she needs to go learn how to train her dogs and how to control her dogs. And to every pet dog out, owner out there, so do you. You need to stimulate and fulfil your dog's life else. That dog's life is meaningless. Meaningless. You know, to have an unfulfilled dog, you're doing your dog a disservice. You know, I don't mean to be rude. I don't mean to upset anybody or offend anybody. But I'm sure you all know by now that I just say it as it is. And yeah, I am angry. You know, it's taken me 36 hours to get over PTSD. You know, and I have not reacted. You know, I just froze. I froze as soon as she hit me. Fr I froze. And Zed got in between us. She put a pause on my chest and pushed me back into safety and brought me back to the here and now. People, come on. You know, please train your dog. Okay. <laughs>